Hi, my name is Dr. Fiona Barry. I have a PhD in pharmacology and I run two women's wellbeing clinics in my native Cork. I also have a licentiate in Chinese medicine and I integrate the two medicines when I'm dealing with my own clients in my clinics. Initially, when a woman enters menopause, it starts with perimenopause. Uh, peri just means around, so it's the transitionary period before a woman actually hits menopause. So perimenopause can be divided into early and late perimenopause. Early would be where the menstrual cycle still is pretty regular, and but unfortunately you're probably not ovulating every cycle. This means that progesterone levels decrease, but oestrogen levels remain high, and this can lead to certain signs and changes in a woman's body. Late perimenopause is then when the oestrogen levels also drop, and therefore a, a woman might find that actually her period starts to, the cycle starts to lengthen out, and the periods may become a little bit more irregular. Most women obviously recognise that, um, but it's the early perimenopause for a lot of women that they don't realise what's going on in their body. The changes happen over anything from kind of seven to ten years, so a lot of the times the changes are subtle. A lot of the time I'd in fact have women coming into me in clinic and they just don't understand what's going on with them. And the, the biggest question I get asked is what's happening to me? Why am I feeling like this? I've lost me. I guess first and foremost, reassurance is the, the main thing and education is huge. Um, knowledge is power and when we know what's going on with us, then we can take control of it and you can actually decide on the path that your journey takes. I think because we're having kids older, many women are having kids in their early 40s, that suddenly to find themselves in perimenopause maybe a year or two later is really a bit startling for them and they, something they haven't even considered. The average age of menopause is 51. However, realistically, when it comes to perimenopause, anything from the early 40s is, is, is feasible. The average age for perimenopause is about 45. I had been spent so long recommending so many different products to women when they were coming into me in clinic. They were having to take a bit of this and a bit of that in a bid really to try and support all the systems that needed to be supported during this important transitionary period and, and for afterwards. Now finally we have a product, Menoactive, which is a comprehensive product and has 30 active ingredients, all of which support the systems in the body that are affected by menopause, such as their digestive system, their immune function, their cognitive function and psychological function. And that's why we specifically picked the ingredients that we did. There's 30 active ingredients in this product. There are things like digestive enzymes, there's a whole plethora of vitamins and minerals, there's also botanicals, and there's also a high quantity of DHA, which is omega-3.